it is me judy welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel for today's video you guys i'm gonna be showing you guys what is on my iphone 11 pro max if you see my channel hi it's me judy and welcome or welcome back the case that i got is so cute i got it from a korean boutique in flushing so go check it out so i have like this color budget app Facebook, Twitter, Messenger, Snapchat, Instagram, GroupMe, Kakao Talk, Spotify, TikTok, Pinterest, YouTube, YouTube Studio. I'll show you guys all the apps that I have. So we're just gonna scroll through this from A to Z. We have Amazon, you guys know. I love Amazon. Among Us, App Store, Apple Store, Bitmoji, Blackboard for school. Books, calculator, calendar, camera, cash app, chase, chrome, chromic is an editing app, clips, clock, color widgets, which were, which is really useful for this whole iOS update, color tone is another editing app, compass, connects, app, contacts, diary, I don't really use that diary app that much so don't worry about it so we have dictionary discover google docs google drive duolingo is a really good app if you are learning another language facebook facetime which i don't really use that much files find my iphone fitness or kind of like activity app Flow is a period tracker app, really, really helpful, and it's free. Flora is a focus tracker app. Filter is a, you can actually get free Lightroom presets over here. Yep, free. Fly Delta, GarageBand, I don't really use this in this phone. Gmail. Google Calendar, really, really helpful. Health, Home, Huji, Huji is one of my favorite. iMovie, InShot, another video editing app. Instagram, Kakao Talk, Camon, Keynote, Lightroom, Lyft, Mail, Maps, Measure, Messages, Messenger, Mobile Legends, Mahela, Motivation, Music, my verizon netflix news notes notion numbers pages pages phone fonto that's where i edit my thumbnails on fonto photos pix art i sometimes edit my thumbnail there pinterest podcast prequel i use this in tiktok so profit source Quizlet, good app. Rakuten, it's a cashback app. You you get cashback over here, something like that. Reddit, is it Reddit? Reddit. I don't know. Reminders, really really helpful app. Safari, Sephora, settings, Google Sheets, Shein, shortcuts, Slack, slides snapchat spotify follow my spotify starbucks even though i haven't been in starbucks for like a good year so stocks study bunny check out my recent video because i actually mentioned that td bang tiktok tips transit translate to buddy apple tv twitter go follow me on twitter uber venmo video store video lib B L L O, voice memos, Visco wallet, Walmart watch, ways, Twitter, widget Smith, which is gonna be another thing that's useful in this iOS 14 update. Workout women, Yelp, YouTube, YouTube Studio, YouTube Studio is where content creators use to track the comments analytics and so on and so forth zero is a fast fasting app zoom you probably know this 
and 1998 cam. Those are just the apps that I have. So I'm gonna show you how I designed my home screen. So first I used this app called Color Widgets. So the thing that you see over here, first thing you gotta do is of course update your phone. You don't know where to go. Go to settings. Go to general. Go to software update and it should show up that you gotta update it so you're gonna update that and it takes about an hour to update download color widgets and color widgets on your app store and it should show you this thing for example we're gonna use buttercup and you kind of want that one you're just gonna click that edit widget you can edit the font we have different fonts actually over here different theme and you can actually change the background photo so for example you want this picture right here and that's just how it's gonna look just giving you a preview on what it looks like if you're gonna choose small medium and large hold the home screen press the plus button search for color widgets and then if you want the the small one just add widget and it's gonna add on your screen now we move everything else so obviously i already have mine i'm just gonna delete that and then remove Oh my god, it shifted everything. And then press the plus button. Press, I mean press. <laughs> Search for the reminders. And you can choose what size you want. I just prefer the small one because I don't really want my reminders to be showing up in my home screen. Next app that you can download is this app called Widget Smith, which obviously you can see. The second page is full of widget smith, except the other one is the fasting, the fasting app. You're gonna go to app store, download widget smith, and when you download it, you can open widget smith. Um, you could choose what you want, you can choose a small widget, you can choose a medium widget, you can choose a large widget, it's up to you. Add small widget, tap that one tap again I keep saying tap and you can you can change it um, if you only want dates or if you want a photo you could go to custom photo selected photo for example you want this photo after that save and then remember what number is it small number seven widget smith and add widget small and ta -da, it's over there but if you don't want to you hold the picture that you want to change all the time edit widget and for example you don't want number seven you want number three i don't even know what number three is oh you can also add other apps as well you can add fitness you can add clock for that one you gotta go to shortcuts and obviously over here you're gonna see all the apps that I actually customized already so press plus button add action search open app press choose for example you wanna change the icon of among us and then press the three dots on the upper right and then shortcut name just put among us add to home screen 
press the little icon over there, choose photo, and then make sure you change the shortcut name among us. Add, press done, press done again, and it should show up right there over here. So it's very very easy and honestly the only downside that I'm kinda kinda annoyed is that when you click for example let me see when you click for example TikTok it doesn't direct you to that thing scared me if you have any questions make sure to like comment and subscribe feel free to message me on one of my social media accounts which will be linked down in the description box down below thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in my next one make sure to i think my lights are flickering thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys Oh, yeah.